Hey guys, welcome back. Um, it's not been very long because after I got ended the episode, recording the last episode. Uh, so this is Stone Block episode 16, I think. <laughs> uh, I realized I didn't try an importer. I tried the interface, but I didn't try an importer. I think my thinking was that it would go ahead and as soon as I injected into uh, the energizing uh, thing it would go ahead and get sucked in from an importer so let's try that I just made one and I thought we'd go ahead and give it a shot so I did restart my uh, PC also so not all a bad thing that was kind of distracting me too okay so put that back and then put the tool away. <laughs> All right, so let's look at our importer. Um, it can be set up with the redstone, items, blacklist, exact, exact mode. Okay, so let's uh, let's take off, that cable's not doing anything, I've left it there. Let's take off the interface. And let's go ahead and uh, request some uh, steel, Energizing steel. Isn't that? Thought it was control and then you clicked, but anyway, we'll just remove it there. And let's request 10 and start. Okay. That seems to be working. And we can check our crafting monitor uh, just to make sure everything went fine. Okay, all right. Looks like it worked. Uh, let's do. Um, what was the other item that we put in the, the crafter? Uh, yeah, the inner core. Let's get those out. Let's uh, craft up uh, 10 of those. And then we'll do uh, 10 of the inner the steel again, too. And we'll just check them and make sure everything's working fine. Oh, there we go. We got a problem. Okay. That's what I was afraid of. So I might have to change my setup. That's going to keep trying to. Let's go cancel. Cancel it all. Best way is try to, to make it not work <laughs> to find if it's going to stay working, right? Okay, that should have worked there for that last one. Uh, so what do we get this on? So after auto crafting, pulse inserts next set. Um, that might work. Uh, we had a high signal going here, so I don't know what. <clears throat> excuse me. Let's let's try it though. Um, that was enter, and then we want, um, steel. That way I can see both of these things at the same time. Get those out of there. Let's craft, uh, let's craft the enter stuff first. Again, we'll do 10, and I backed out before I started it. And start, start, and then craft 10, start, start. Looks like it's working even though it's, uh, I've got a set on pulse and I've got a high redstone signal coming into it. Okay. 
So uh, I think I think I probably didn't, did take care of it. Okay. All right, guys. Uh, I'll be back in a minute, and we'll go over what, what the episode's going to be over with. Be over. Uh, the main thing was getting that fixed, and like I said, I'm kind of reporting this back to back because I uh, it was kind of bothering me that I, I forgot. I mean, it's just kind of like a brain fart. <laughs> Literally, hey, there's Justin. He's the guy hosting the, uh, or Inner Nature, the guy that's hosting the uh, uh, server for me. And he's playing too, so it's cool. Um, so anyway, I'll be back in a minute. And we'll go over what the, this episode's going to be about. Okay, uh, be back in a few. Bye. Hey, guys, welcome back. Here we're here. we got some good stuff going on. Uh, we've got the crafting monitor, which we had from the last episode. You see I built some more crafters. Uh, we've got a crafting manager so we can see what's going on with everything. And over here in our, uh, let's see. Energizing orb. I've added uh, the blaze rod pattern for making the blazing crystal, which is just one uh, blaze rod in there and then uh, take some power to energize it. And we get that. <clears throat> that allows us to get up to the... Uh, uh, the blazing furnator, which uh, is really good. So, and then we got over here the flood grid, which I just need to make for the uh, uh, quest. So if I go over here, I want to get two more of these. I've took the two of the three out, and uh, got one going already over here. So, and it's generates quite a bit of. Let's see where it says here. 800 FE per tick. So this should be, oh, we don't have, I need to put that furnator over in a different location. And put these two, see, let's put those in. Uh, blazing. Let's put the blazing one up here. We can get our power. There we go. And then that should be making our other furnators, the blazing ones. So one. Let's see where we're at in the crafting recipes. It's working its way through there. I didn't put any speed upgrades in them yet or anything, so. I think they're doing fine. So let's put that one there. And that one there. So I'm just trying to upgrade everything to the blazing level. Uh, I'll probably do the rods next year. So let's see what's involved with those. Um, we need to have some capacitors, two of each of those. So let's craft up uh, let's see uh, let's go back and look at the the rods. So it's the blazing capacitor is what I need, which is those. So in craft, let's just do uh, twelve. Then we need uh, these. You kind of got to do manually. So let's make sure we have uh, six of these. Should have those on uh, crafting too. Casing, dielectric casing. So we need six. Those are being made pretty fast. Okay, so let's grab those out. And then we need to get our uh, blazing capacitors. Uh, we need we need more than that. There's 10. Should have two more coming. Uh, let's go ahead and make another 10 so it'll be ready.
it gets us our 12 we need. It's probably going to be making some. Yeah. We'll wait till it gets done. We'll take our rods off and do those. Let's upgrade those. Shouldn't be much longer. Yeah, I need to, I made uh, patterns to, to do the upgrades. So I need to put like upgrades because you can put uh, three upgrades and maybe a, 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 I think it's the crafting or maybe just four upgrades. I think it's just four upgrades we need to put in those speed upgrades. Okay, it looks like that's done. So let's go ahead and grab these. I could have made new ones, but that's kind of, it's kind of pointless to make new ones because you got to use these for crafting. So, all right, looks like I broke the cables too. Uh, I think we'll be okay on our cables. So let's go in and upgrade those to the blazing. Wish it would keep my stuff there. Um, but we just grab these and up, up, uh, update them, upgrade them one by one. I could throw them probably in the system. After breaking them and then uh, upgrade them that way, but figured there's no point in it. We could just do it this way manually. It's a one time thing. I don't think we'll be doing a setup anywhere else for these. Maybe it might move these, but that'd be about it. Okay, so those are upgraded to the blazing. Our cables are still just to harden, I believe. Yep. Which, uh, see how much power they have. We might want to update those at some point, but I don't think it's something we got to do right now. The uh, reason I'm doing this, I want to get ready. Maybe we'll do the reactor. Uh, we do also have, uh, let's see, the cells. Where's the cells? The energy cells are in here that we want to get because that's wireless power. Let's also, while we're at it, just look and see if we got any of uh, the, uh, the flux network stuff. We do have that storage and a controller, so we're good there. So we could start outputting some storage to those. Uh, since we're having power down here, let's just uh, put them here, I guess. Get the controller. And let's go ahead and uh, name it. Lucky Mess Network. Oh, they have one already. Okay, so we want to have a different one. There's is locked, which I don't want that one anyway. Um, oh, I need to create one. Duh. Okay, so we're going to create this. Let's make. I like to make my power kind of reddish, and I'm not worried about a password. Right, it's going to make me put a password in, it, isn't it? Public, scripted. Let's do private and create it. Okay, so that's on there. So let's get us a plug out. Because we got all these from the bees. And the plug, we can take power out. And I think. We want to do power out. I think we'll do power out of this one, this energy cell here. Now let's see. Do we get? Yeah, it's upgraded. Okay. Do we get the? I think we get the the highest augment. Yeah. Okay. So let's change this to my network. Okay. Now we have wireless power. Should be getting power over here if I set it up. Okay. 
Let's see, plug storage. Okay, the plug. Oh, I don't have it set here in the middle on this. So, so at the front should be output. Now we're getting power. Okay. So we got that. Uh, we do have some points, I believe, too, so we could use those if we needed to. Yeah, I have uh, the battery that I've been using. It's got 40 million R, uh, R, RF in it, RFE. So I'm not worried about the wireless right now, or me on my personal uh, or personal uh, power. Uh, but if we need to make any other uh, additions, we can use those. I could take away this cable probably, and uh, let's see, well, we could put power on those too, into it. But I think we're getting enough from this furnator anyway. Let's see what what we're getting here. Thousand uh, FE right now, so that's pretty good because it's it's allowing us to get more out of this. Then uh, let's see if we can we just max that out. We should be full. Yeah, we're getting to four thousand now. Okay, so I think power we got situated pretty good. Power, and then the power. This stuff uh, I think we'll we might go. I mean these furnitures are pretty good, right? So we might upgrade those. Let's see, does this got the full max in it? Let's go ahead and end up. Upgrade the uh, output and input. Might as well do that too. Um, and those are maxed out because we got the uh, upgrade augments in them. So uh, there is some, I think, uh, flux. Uh, it's, I forget what the, the items are called. Let's see. Augs, which weren't at. Is it this one? They tell you which machine they go into, but uh, so those aren't the right warrants. Let's see. Redstone flux. So you can use these also. To increase the uh, capacity or in the uh, the transfer rate and stuff. Uh, we may do those later. I'm not worried about them right now. Just to know that they're there. Uh, the only reason these are here is so I can get up here and, and break these cables if I need to upgrade those. Because um, they, how much storage will they do? Let's look at hardened cables. Do 5k each, and right now we're uh, outputting uh, 3.2. So they're put outputting as much as more than we can uh, make right now. Now we could, like I said, go to the next level, and we probably will do that. I might do it in between episodes because once you see it done, you kind of see how it works. I'm just going to probably put the next upgrade for. Uh, let's look and see what it is. Uh, my shift is not working. Okay, there we go. Power. And then we want to look at, uh, let's see, what is the next? So we got the hardened capacitor, the blazing capacitor, the ni niotic will be the next. So let's save that. And then we need to make these, which is a diamond. Okay, so let's, let's go ahead and make a, the pattern for that. We might do the patterns for these. Okay. So let's go up here. And we'll do the pattern for that. That's just a crafting recipe. And then uh, we'll need to do this, which will be um, these, which we energize the diamond. So that's a processing recipe. So that's why the crafting manager is nice to have. Uh, it's the monitor to go down to the manager. 
because we can just put uh, so like this one is a crafting recipe we could put it in here and then we want to go down to uh, the energizing orb and we could put this processing one in here all right so what's the next that gets like I said that's kind of a pain but next is spirited so let's get a crafting recipe and we'll see what the energizing orb recipe is here it's an emerald okay no problem so let's go ahead and go to a nitro get the processing recipe again we're just uh seeing what we need to get here and for energizing to, oh, okay so it's quite a bit here for this those will need a recipe for again i don't have another star so i can't do that one either but we can go ahead and put it down here okay so i think that gets everything uh we do need to add a recipe for uh these And that's going to be a processing because it's uh, going to have to be energized. And then if we look, what the blaze mesh, which we'll need a recipe for that, which is just a crafting recipe. So let's go back over here to our storage manager. See crafting, crafting. That's energizing. This will be a crafting. And so these need to go into the energizing. Oh, I just shift clicked to those in the wrong spot. So let's take those back out. I just have to place them in here manually. Okay, so we get uh, got it set up to here. Uh, we we got any nether stars. So I think maybe the dungeon is we'll we'll head next episode. I don't think we have a time for today, but uh, we can start getting some more stuff ready and see what we want i think uh as far as armor we're pretty good uh i've got my awesome ring and we know how the upgrade works on it uh, by pressing g so let's put those in here uh let's see what else do we need we got food i won't need my power book or the cables i don't think water's going to work for us there um we got the other dungeons, so next next episode we'll definitely do some dungeon exploring. Got our pocket storage. We got a dugout. The only thing I might want to do is look at RF tools for uh, portals. And maybe just for around the base too would be a good idea to have, uh, I forget what these things are called. Um, I think it's RF tools that has those. These are what we're probably transmitter and receiver. I don't know. I think we have to have both of those for each location. And maybe look at those two the chargers. Let's see. I thought there was we're around the base. Let's see, maybe it's called Ender. That's not what I'm looking for. Patient wand, travel staff, anchors. Maybe that's what it's called. Yeah, I think it's yeah, the travel anchors. Okay, so let's let's set a recipe for that because I got an idea that we're probably at least cut pretty high on iron, but we have those. Oh, and the travel staff. That's not what we want there. Um, do that travel. I thought you had to have a rod. So let's, let's just, um, I think we, get, we got a crafting recipe for that. 
just stick it in here. And let's make a couple of those. Okay. I haven't used them to be honest. Uh, so let's go ahead and make in a long time. And we'll call this uh, the power room. Enter. And let's go to, and we'll just stick one here too, I think. We'll call this one home. Now, I, I know, I think there's some kind of staff we gotta have. Didn't think it was that, but let's, let's go ahead and make it and see. Okay, it is actually that. So why are we not seeing, we could, you should be able to see the one down here. Or, so I can just right click and go up here. Oh, there's the power, okay, so it's close. So yeah, we'll be able to make these to get around the base a lot easier. So let's go ahead and make a couple more. Uh, why not four? Okay, so let's go back up to home. And then we, we'll have one over here for our crate room. Uh, let's get rid of this guy. They like to get up there and bounce around. I mean, I understand, guys. It's fun, right? Okay, so let's put one here. I need to finish the floor here, too. I got busy and didn't finish up the floor. So we'll stick one here and call it create. Okay, and then uh, that one, and we'll have a mechanism room one. Just stick it right here in the middle. We'll just call it mech. And let's see, make sure we can see it. Yep. That's pretty cool. And I think we'll put one uh, uh, here by the farms. Uh, we'll call this one, not really farm. Uh, Let's call it uh, animals. Then I want one over here. And in the center here, I guess would work. And I'm going to call this one crops. Now, I, we can't use these for the to travel very far, but just around the base. Should work pretty good. So we got mechanism. Let's see if we can get all the way over to there. Yep. And then animals, crops. Yeah, this is going to be great traveling around the base. Okay, so I just need to get to teleportation. We'll use the RF tools for that. It needs power, which Having the wireless power now will work good for that, I think. Uh, I'll set those up in between episodes because if you remember, uh, they're out quite a ways. So I'll set one up here, probably one here, uh, maybe one here. All right, we, I guess yeah, I could actually just set it up right there by the entry. And then one out here, and I still need to go find uh, the end uh Fortress, little sword, or whatever these things are called in here. So, uh, dungeon or whatever. So, okay, guys, I hope you enjoyed the episode, and I'll see you in the next one. Uh, bye.